Neetu has an initial capital of 20,000. Out of this, she invests 8,000 at 5% in Bank A, 5,000 at 5.6% in Bank B. So 20, oops, say 20K, 8K at 5.5%. 5k at 5.6%. The remaining at x percent in bank B. 8 plus 5 is 13. 7k at C at x percent. Her combined annual interest income from these investments is equal to 5% of the initial capital. Nice. 5.5, 5.6, overall being 5. This should be lower. If she had invested her entire capital in bank C alone, then her annual income would have been. So we find this x percent and then we are through. Overall average is 5 point, is 5 percent. We can find the averages and then simplify with the weighted average thing or find the actual amount. 8k at 5.5 percent is 440. 5 percent is 400, another half percent, 440. 5.6 percent at 5k is 280. 20k at 5 percent is, is 1000. 440 plus 280 is 0 to 720. So this, our 7K gets her 280. 1000 minus 720. Which is a, a return of 4%. 5.5, 5.6 will average to 5.55, something there. That is at 4%. Built average closer to this. Yeah, it should work, 5%. We're getting 4%. If you had invested the entire amount there, 20k at 4% gives us a rather juicy, simple arithmetic question. We should look at this and gobble it up.